What's up guys, welcome to the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be going over how to stream directly to YouTube from your PlayStation 5 as well as your Xbox Series X and S. Also, how to fix the verification issue that a lot of people experience on the PlayStation 5. Okay, so we're gonna start with the PlayStation 5. You have to be in a game for it to allow you to use the broadcast feature. So we're just gonna go ahead and jump into Deathloop right here. Okay, so what you're gonna to wanna to do is hit the PlayStation button and then go over to broadcast. It's going to ask you to pick between Twitch and YouTube. Um, the first time you do this, it's going to ask you to log into your YouTube account. So you'll go ahead and you'll log in. And then after you do that, it's going to pop up and tell you that um, you need to verify your phone number. If you've already verified your phone number through your Google account, it's just going to pop up and tell you it's complete. Okay, now the issue that you're going to run into if you don't follow this next step is it's just going to sit there and say that your YouTube account is going to take 24 hours to verify pretty much forever. I left it sitting for a week and it's still never verified. I did a lot of Google searching and all of the resolutions that I saw said that you needed to use your PlayStation 4, go to that, sign into YouTube and verify your account that way. I don't know if that will fix the issue that I had. Um, I do have a PlayStation 4, but honestly, it's just in a box in the closet, so I don't feel like pulling it out. And also, I do realize that some people may get a PlayStation 5 that have never, that never had a PlayStation 4 before, so that's not going to be a real good solution for them. So what I did find that you had to do, and this might just be a dumb error on my part that I didn't think of this, you're going to want to go to YouTube on either your cell phone or your PC, um, and then once you're into your YouTube account, you're gonna click the little camera icon in the top right and hit go live. And once you've done that, it's gonna take you into YouTube stu Studios. Then it's gonna pop up and ask you if you want to um, stream now or make a stream for later. Um, go ahead and hit stream now or later, it doesn't really matter. Then after you do that, it's gonna ask you if you wanna use your webcam um, or a streaming software like OBS. And after that, it's going to pop up and tell you that it's going to take 24 hours for YouTube to verify your account to stream. This is what you have to do um, to get your PlayStation 5 stream to work. After the 24 hours is up, you don't have to go back into YouTube Studios and do anything. So if you're just streaming directly from your console, um, it will then unlock the button. So when you click it, it's going to um, now give you the option to go live. You can also set your title change your description and put any type of game tags that you want into it as well um if you've already used live on your youtube account before you won't have to do this process but if it's the first time using you do have to wait that 24 hour period now to stream from your xbox there is no like youtube button to hit so you're going to have to use this um, service called aircast and what this is going to do is whenever you stream directly to twitch from your xbox it's also going to start a stream on youtube for you um so you're going to have to go to aircast create an account they do have a free tier that's going to let you only stream to one outlet so you're going to go ahead and sign in um link your twitch account and then after you do that you're going to hit add stream output select youtube and then you're going to need to get your streamer key to do this you have to go back into your youtube studios and that will have your stream key you're just going to want to copy it and then paste it to aircast and then once you've done that um, it will stream from your twitch to your youtube anytime so then you'll go in your xbox and to stream to twitch it's super easy you just download the twitch app on the xbox sign in and then it will give you the option to live stream from your xbox you will have to go to aircast every time if you're gonna do a different stream and want to change the title you'll just go there um and create it it's not gonna like automatically copy your twitch stream um title so that is one thing that you have to keep in mind you're also going to want to make sure you have auto start cut on so that way anytime you cut it on in your xbox it'll automatically do it and you won't have to go into aircast and do it manually if you want to use facebook gaming you will have to get their premium service or just stream to multiple different outputs um, it's five pounds, which is around like six eighty um, a month. Or they do have a um, 
a 50 pound option which would come out to almost like 70 bucks and that plan is for the year so you'll get um essentially two months free if you do that um i hope you found this video helpful if you did please like also consider subscribing um i got a lot of more videos coming your way i will start to live stream here um pretty soon and that will be death loop demon slayer after that comes out as well as um vanguard whenever that finally drops and i will be doing a full um dark matter camo grind series for that as well so there's a lot of stuff coming so please consider subscribing thank you